since I've come to office, all they've really done is attack me and my economic plan. For all the time they spend attacking me and my plan, here's what they never do. They never talk about what they want to do. No, no. Think about it. They tell you what they're against. What are they for? It's like they want to keep it a secret. I don't blame them, because the country should know the facts. They should know the choice between Bidenomics and Maganomics. Now Republicans in Congress are doubling down with a plan that does three things. One, it cuts taxes even more for the very wealthy and big corporations. Two, it cuts Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid. Three, it raises costs for families gutting investments in the middle class. And now they're turning their backs on the bipartisan budget deal. Senator Speaker McCarthy made, me, made with me just a few months ago after threatening to do something no one and came very close to doing it, shutting down and reneging on our national debt, which would have caused an international economic crisis. Under my predecessor, you remember the self-professed king of debt? Well, it turned out he was. He's actually the emperor of debt. There's only two presidents in American history with fewer jobs the day they left office than when they started. One was President Hoover, and the other was Donald Hoover Trump. <laughs> you just got to remember who we are. We are the United States of America. There is nothing beyond our capacity. God bless you all.